Hey guys, this is John from 99Bitcoins and in this video, I'm going to teach you how to grow your Bitcoins by 20% each year on autopilot. Now, a lot of people have gotten into Bitcoins in order to make some sort of a profit. But since the exchange rate isn't as volatile as it was a year ago, it's getting kind of hard to actually profit from just buying and holding on to your Bitcoins. The good news is that there's actually another way for you to grow your Bitcoins on an annual monthly or even weekly basis and this is called peer-to-peer -peer lending and it's basically the idea of lending someone your bitcoins and getting them to pay you back with an interest since these lending methods are less traditional you can get crazy returns out of them for example here at 99 bitcoins we are currently investing our bitcoins at the 9.3 interest rate for just two months of investing and there is absolutely no way that you could get such a return anywhere else in the market but as you know, with great rewards also comes great risks. And, you know, finding those investment opportunities, it's really not that easy. Anyway, have no fear. That's exactly what this video is for. So let me show you a quick tutorial on how to grow your Bitcoins. First, go to btcjam.com. This is the site that we're going to loan our Bitcoins through. BTC Jam is a startup company which was founded in 2012 and specializes in giving out Bitcoin loans. Go ahead and sign up to the site. I won't go over this because it's all pretty standard. What I would like to go over though is how you can find the right investment. Once you're logged in, if you click on invest, you'll see all sorts of investment listings showing up. What I usually do is order them by percent funded and look for investments that are almost 100% funded. Next thing I do is I examine the profile of the guy requesting for the investment. I want to see that this is an actual person, that his credentials are okay, and mainly that he has already repaid some of the loans that he did in the past. I'm also looking for how long he has been a member of BTC Jam, making sure that he just didn't sign up last week or anything like that. After that, I examine the listing rating and borrower's reputation. I want to make sure that he has a decent rating on his listing and that there are no negative reviews about him. Finally. I go over the project description and make sure that it makes sense to me. Also, I examine the interactions on this specific listing to see how active this borrower is. I'm mainly looking for signs that this person has thought this loan throughout and is willing to back it up by responding to the general crowd of lenders. Only after everything checks out that I take a look at the actual interest rate of the investment. The reason is that most investments are going to generate a high yield anyway, and it's much more important to choose the person you're lending money to rather than filtering them by profit. And that's basically it. I'm now ready to make my investment and get paid back with interest. Before we conclude, I just want to say a couple more things. Please take this guy with a grain of salt and make sure that you do your own research as well. I'm not an investment expert and you know everything that I'm sharing here on this video is based solely on my own personal experience. Also, never invest more than you can afford to lose. When you invest through BTC Jam, you're basically giving away your money to strangers and no matter how good your research was, sometimes bad things will happen. So remember, your money's still at risk. Last but not the least, if you do decide to invest, make sure to spread your investments on as many good investments that you can find. This way, if something does go wrong, you won't have all your eggs in one basket. To sum things up, you can grow your Bitcoins at an amazing rate using peer-to-peer -peer lending. But it's important to take caution with who you lend your Bitcoins to. If this video helped you out, I'd appreciate you liking it, tweeting about it, or sharing it on Facebook. And I'll see you on the next video.